With the raging controversy surrounding the safety of genetically modified maize, mealtimes are now turning into moments of fear, anxiety and heated discussions. But they shouldn't, at least not according to scientists. It's not some monster, it's still maize, except that it has this gene that helps it to fight insect pests. This genetic modification, though, is responsible for the anxiety, especially now that the government has authorized importation of GMOs to stabilize maize supply. Wale watu ambao sasa mimi na waone uruma ni vijana, sababu sasa hawa ndi wako kwa kazi ya kuzalisha. Na hii mambo unasikia kwamba inapunguza, na hata inamaliza. Sasa hiyo ndi otatizo kubwa sana ndi onona mimi na kwa na wasiwasi. All this hula balu is misinformation, is propaganda, is instilling fear in people. It has no scientific backup. The introduction of the pest-resistant gene in maize to enhance its yields was considered a hallmark in the field of agriculture, which helped to boost food security. According to scientists, a GMO crop goes through laboratory testing, greenhouse conditions and confined field testing to ascertain that it meets all safety requirements before it's commercially released. Agricultural productivity experts are convinced that GMO is the way to go as the alternative. If we stopped use of inorganic fertilizers in the world and opted for organic fertilizers or organic manures, the productivity will go down by over 100 percent and you can never feed people. The Consumer Federation of Kenya is, however, of the view that food insecurity in the country is a problem of food distribution rather than food production. Sylvia Tibet. Citizen Live at 9, Nairobi.